Okay, we're going to do a little hole sawing here, and this is on just one of your um, your two foot diameter rounds that you cut out uh, for the body of the uh, the turbine. Um, now, it's basically all we're going to do is we're going to measure in from the outside four inches and five eighths on each of your eight pie sections, and uh, we're going to. Uh, center punch, uh, pilot drill, and then we're going to pull saw through this uh, eight times. And, and all these holes are for is uh, for one for drainage, uh, since this is going to be the bottom of your turbine uh, in case any water gets in there. Uh, and also for access to, uh, you're going to have a master, a master blade here on your, on your rotor, and you're going to need, need to be able to get your screwdriver in from underneath to take that out to get access to the nut on your your alternator or or a fixed magnet motor however you're mounting that and without that you uh, all the other rotors are, are permanently fixed on here there'll be one you can take out okay and so these holes will give you access to get your screwdriver in there and pull that that one master master uh, blade out okay so just real quick we're gonna uh, take our center punch punch Pilot drill, and uh, now I'm cutting this out with the uh, a seven eighths uh, hole saw. Uh, you can use a five eighths. You can use a larger one. It, it really that it, it isn't really that critical. Like I said, it's just for drainage and access for your screwdriver to get through. So I'm using a seven eighths, but if all you have is your five eighths, that that'll work fine. You just need these. And I find that it helps to go one direction and then flip it over and then meet it in the middle. That way, that way you don't break out on one side and kind of, you know, splinter the board. So, anyway, so go ahead and and uh, and uh, hole saw your your eight holes there for the clearance for our screwdriver and drainage.